my walk around of my 2014 E350 Econoline Super Duty XLT Quad Van. Now this has the 5.4 liter engine. It has the F350 bolt-in four-wheel drive system manual. And it has a positive traction uh, rear end. Now what I've done in the uh, cab area, driver's side, is I put in a, a rear camera uh, and you might be able to see the display up there. Doesn't look like it's coming through too well, a little bit. And then there's a forward looking camera to record. But that rear facing camera, it basically replaces that rear view mirror, which is the rear view mirrors worthless looking through uh, the rear. It has full limousine tint on top of the factory tinted window so you can't see in during the day. See very well outdoors uh, during the day. At night I would expect you could see in pretty easily. The uh, Rear area is a, uh, since I tow a Wilderness 30 foot 2750 RL Heartland travel trailer, uh, this becomes the rigging work area when I'm towing, or it can convert to a, a galley uh, if I go for a van trip uh, only. But, I built that structure and again that fits in there very well makes it very usable and that comes out very simply uh, once it's unsecured down here is where I place that rear view camera right there again that's on full time and that disconnects and plugs into a rear camera on the back of the travel trailer. So I always have rear view um, functionality there. You know what's going on behind or backing up. Internally here I've uh, installed a, a sofa bed that I pulled out of the uh, travel trailer. In the slide there I put up the entertainment center didn't need this. It has a rear living area with bucket seats and the travel trailer, so this was an extra a bonus to put in here. They have the porta potty, those little fans help circulate the air uh, when uh, parked. Of course, it has full air conditioning uh, throughout the cab area. Uh, Installed the Cobra handheld CD, it's got a K40 a whip mag mount, and this is the passenger tire area. I put uh, little pads there to increase the, uh, the ride height, uh, gives a little more visibility uh, when on the road sitting on the fire. What I did as well, because of the uh, height of this van, is I put in a uh, power step, which makes it very easy to get in and out. Almost a must for passengers trying to get in. I just jump up on the driver's side. Anyway, that is the quad van that you'll see in various other videos and the function that it's used. Have a great day.
I want you to get up and walk like a duck. Me? Yes. I always walk like a duck. What are you talking about? <laughs> Do the duck walk. Hey, Molly, let's do the duck walk. Do the duck walk.